Bonjour mes amis, it's Curly Guy here and I am boop, 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 back with another video. And in today's video, I'm just going to be talking about, from the title you can see, I'm going to be talking about nursing school um, and how am I doing, how well am I doing. So basically, um, I'm doing okay so far. Um, I have to admit, this first five weeks, the first session or the first semester is five weeks and it's pretty, pretty difficult because it's a lot of material and it's only five weeks. So let me just break it down for you. Um, so far, we've had three tests in one class and then we've had two tests in the other class. Okay, one of the classes is Foundations um, of Nursing and the other one is Intro to Professional Nursing or something like that. Okay, in the intro class where we've had two tests, I made a 92 on the first one and then I made a 97 on the last one. So I have like an average of like a 95 or something like that. It's around there. I have I have a 95 in the class. Um, now as far as the other class, which is the more difficult one, um, which is the foundations class that goes along with our clinicals and everything. I'm doing great with clinicals, but the class on the first test and the second test, I made an 82 on both of them. Now I know you guys are like an 82. That sounds pretty good, but you have to be mindful that in nursing school, you're on a seven point scale. So a 82 is still a C. Um, and it, in fact, an 83 would be a B minus. So you have to keep in mind that even though I made an 82 on the first two tests, I'm already at a C. And then on this last test, which was the most difficult test, I've actually made a 74, um, which is the lowest grade that I've made on anything since I've been in this uh, program. Luckily, we still have a final and then we have one assignment to submit. So that'll compensate for it. And the final exam is worth, I believe, 25% of the class. So I will be able to recover with the final if I study really hard and everything. But overall, I'm not really too stressed out. My average in that class right now is a 79. And in the nursing program, as I said, you're on a seven point scale. So you actually need a 76 to pass the class. So currently I am, you know, passing the class. Um, I don't want to be that student that just skates by through nursing school. I know a lot of people do that. A lot of people get the bare minimum. Um, I don't want to do that, but this being my first semester, that may happen with this class. Um, I am going to try to score really high on the final exam. I do want to get a, either a high B or, well, of course we want an A, but I'll settle for a high B, um, maybe like a 90 or something like that. And that'll just toggle my grade back into the 80s range, which is, I'm okay with that. Um, hopefully I'll get overall that I have like an 85 or above in the class because that way I'll have a B. Um, but so far the nursing um, clinicals have been going well. We went to clinicals. We have to go three more times for clinicals for this semester and it'll be over. You guys have to remember this is a five week course. Um, this is a five week semester. So we literally only have a week and a half left of school before we take our finals. Um, and I have to say, I've learned a lot, but it has been very fast paced. The fall will slow down a little bit because we have two in the fall. We'll have two eight week classes and then two classes that's 16 weeks a regular semester um so that'll be a little bit more relaxed uh it'll still be a lot of information but we'll have more time to study for things and things like that um there are 60 of us in this program and well actually 58 and they broke us down into two groups so each set each group of 20 something students um each group has four instructors and my group, fortunately enough, we have the older instructors, um, so I guess they're pretty much more seasoned instructors, which is good. Um, and then there are four instructors for the other group, and they're actually much, much younger instructors. Um, and so we've actually been doing really good with the clinicals and everything like that. Um, I can tell that our instructors have been nurses for a very, very long time um, because they are very knowledgeable. Um, but yeah. Things are going well so far. Like I said, I'm going to redeem myself with this final exam. Um, but we, we have been stretched very thin. Um, in fact, this uh, what we do, if you make below a 76 on the test, you have to go for remediation, I believe. Um, and I have not been for remediation thus far. And I don't know if they make you do it just if you don't make a 76 on your first test 
or if you make a 76 or below on any of them. This is the first time I made lower than a 76, so I'm not sure. But anyway, um, this is actually the first time, like I said, that I made below, so I don't know if I have to go for remediation or not. They have not emailed me as of yet. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, things will be better in the fall, I'm sure. Hopefully, keep your fingers crossed, guys, that I make it to the fall. Um, like I said, I just need to make at least and I probably, actually, I probably only need to make a 79 um, on this test, but I'm going to try to score in the 80s range just to boost my grade up um, so I don't have to worry about it. But I'm pretty chill. A lot of people, like I said, um, didn't do well on their first test so in, in either class, so they're having to remediate and, you know, get it right for the next couple of tests. Um, I don't know how they did, but like I said, there were uh, there were 60 applicants um, when we seated in the classes, so I don't know how many are still here or what, but um, I'm doing pretty good. I pick up on the information pretty well. The only reason I struggled with this last test is because it was the same week that we started our clinicals, um, so it really knocked out a lot of time that we had to study. When we do our clinicals, they are 10-hour days. Um, so we're at that facility from 7 a.m. to 5 p.m., I believe, or something like that, 7 to 6, 7 to 5. Anyway, we're there an extremely long time, and then after that, we then have to go study for two tests. So that made it a little difficult, but um, it's nothing I can't handle. I think I'm doing pretty well. I don't think I'm going to fail, you guys. So. So just keep me in your prayers. Um, just be thinking about me. Uh, next week, luckily enough, we only have one test. And the thing that happened with this group, when they split us up, the other group of students, the other group of 30, actually had their test spread out. So they had a test on Monday, and then they would have a test on Wednesday. Um, whereas with our group, we had our classes on Thursdays, Tuesdays and Thursdays, and both of our tests ended up falling on Thursday. Um, so it was a little bit more pressure on us, but like I said, it's nothing I can't handle. I'm just going to study, study, study. Thankfully, I only have one test to study for this week, so I can also be studying for the final, getting in preparation for that. Um, and yeah, so um, I think I covered pretty much everything that I wanted to cover. Um, I also, oh yeah, I, another reason, which I'm not making excuses, I don't want you guys to think I'm making excuses or anything, but another thing to note is that I did get sick, like, the first week of school, so I missed, I missed actually two days, two full days of school, which normally wouldn't be a problem, but that's a lot of information that they cover in two days. They covered two chapters that would be on the test, um... So that already put me behind a little bit, which I could recover from that fine and everything. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to come fill you guys in because I know you guys are wondering how I'm doing in nursing school. Some people I, I said in the comments down below of like a last video that they wanted an update on nursing school. So this is somewhat of an update. Um, I'm going to do one more update as far as this semester after we take our final exams. I'll let you guys know how I felt about that. And, of course, if I passed or not, um, which I'm confident that I will. So, don't worry on that front, you guys. But I will be letting you know how I did on everything. Um, <clears throat> I'm trying to think if there's anything I need to, anything else I need to mention to you guys. Mm, I think that's pretty much it, you guys. I do have a room tour coming up. I know you guys can see a little bit of my room. I do have a room tour coming up, but I want to, there's a few more things I want to do. I want to get my pictures for my walls. I want to get my curtain for this window, and that will also help with the lighting being weird just now. And then, it's also a few more, <coughs> a few more things for my bed. And, uh, yeah, I'm pretty much through, though, for the most part. My room is pretty simple. I'm very much a minimalist when it comes to decorating my room. I don't like a lot going on. Um... So yeah, if you guys are wondering why I keep looking over there, it's because I'm using my mirror um, because I don't have my computer hooked up to my viewfinder because I'm using my phone. You guys know I told you about that in the last video, which I will. I'm going to try to get that fixed this weekend so I can start back filming on my camera.
But um, I don't think this quality is bad, you guys. This, I mean, I've seen worse quality. This is this is okay, okay. Um, so without further ado, I know the last time I was the last video I wasn't feeling all that great, but this video I'm feeling much much better. I'm pretty much feeling back to myself. So there will be a b -b 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 bop of the day. So um, let me go ahead and hit you with that. Okay, guys, that was Selena Gomez's new song. Um, I think the name of it is Back To You. I absolutely love that song. I think it's so cute. The video is really cute. Um, and I've kind of been jamming out to it, even when I'm doing my workouts lately. So definitely go check that song out if you have not already. Um, and yeah, don't forget to go ahead and subscribe if this is your first time watching a video of mine. Um, if you like the content, if you like what you've seen. Um, go ahead and subscribe. Um, for you to, who do not know me, talking about nursing school, I am in a nursing program to get my BS in, in um, nursing, my Bachelor's of Science in Nursing. And um, yeah, so if you guys want to see more content like this, give it a good thumbs up. And hopefully we can get this video to 500 likes, despite the quality. <laughs> and um, I'll see you guys in my next video. I have a lot of fun stuff coming up, so stay tuned for that. Bye, guys. <laughs>